Gore-Tex products guaranteed to keep you dry. Now that's a promise. Let's meet two guys who want to put it to the test. The Promise, tested by Gordon and Ted. Episode 3, Masters of Moisture. Ted? Well, that's Ted, my little outdoor professor, and I'm Gordon. And together, we take Gore-Tex products to the challenge. We confront some stubborn myths, and... And find out if the promise really stands. Ah, uh, there you are. And today's promise is... Breathability. Uh, Ted, what's all that about? Ah, that's nothing. It's just to intimidate you a bit. <laughs> Breathability's not that complicated. Check this out. And that is... It's a glove made of expanded polytetrafluoroethylene. What? Expanded polytetrafluoroethylene. Say that again? Expanded polytetrafluoroethylene. Expanded polytetrafluoroethylene. You know, it's gorgeous. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. I also know you like to show off a bit. So I assume we're going to be doing the legendary Gore-Tex fabric breathability test, right? Yep. Yeah. So, kids, hold on to your juice boxes. Here comes Uncle Gordon and his magic glove. Oh, come on, Ted, let me be your lab rat. Gordon's Gore-Tex glove is both waterproof and breathable. And we're going to mm. prove that by drying his wet hand in the glove under ice-cold water. Well, my hand is at the moment dry, so what I'll now do is take off the glove, get my hand soaking wet, whew, put it back inside the glove, and put that into a bowl of water. How's your hand, Ted? Oh, well, I got this glove at the grocery store in the produce section. It's uh, waterproof, but it's a little sweaty and steamy inside. Certainly wouldn't want to go running with these. <laughs> As if you ever go running. Well, so how long is this going to take, Ted? Should we do a fast forward or? No, 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 it won't take long. Just keep your hand in there. Well, at least enlighten us with your wisdom while we wait. Now. A Gore-Tex membrane has over 9 billion pores per square inch. Yeah, and if I remember correctly, those pores are 20,000 times smaller than a droplet of water, making the membrane completely waterproof. Yes, water droplet. Can't get through. However, a water vapor is 700 times smaller than a pore. So the perspiration passes through. Hey, uh, Ted. Where are you going? Ted, what are you doing? Ta-da! Here it is, my tailoring masterpiece. A handmade giant Gore-Tex glove. Now you can submerge an entire person in the water and it's still breathable with all the bells and whistles, sealed seams and so on. Wow, that is very sweet and it matches your eyes perfectly. Well, I think it's time to take a look at my wet, now dry hand. Wonderful. <laughs> hey, now it's your turn to try it on a larger scale in this beauty, huh? Uh, Ted, I'm not going to put that thing on. That is ridiculous. And anyway, you owe me from the last episode. I, I, I made this for you special. It's a gift. It's your size. It'll fit like a glove. Fit <laughs> like a glove. Oh, that, that's that's good stuff. Uh, no, but I'm. Uh, you need somebody wet to be inside it, and since I don't sweat, you, uh, it doesn't really make any sense. You're the perfect candidate since you sweat just getting out of bed. You're right. I. We shouldn't have anybody see a sweat that's dirty and filthy. But still, please, Gordon. Come on, man. So are you happy now, Ted? Oh yeah, I'm doing great. Dry as a bone here. The water's nice and warm. To simulate natural perspiration inside the giant glove, Gordon covered Ted with the approximate amount of water that is evaporated by the body in half an hour of running, sprayed in the usual spots. They chose a shirt to wear inside the glove that changes color when wet. 
It took them several trial runs until they found the ideal testing setup. You should come in. Ah, come on, Ted. You got a little, get a little more active. Put some motion in your ocean. Yeah, you got to generate some body heat. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I feel myself getting dry already. I think it worked. You can pull me in now. Hmm. Garden. Wow. <laughs> what a success. <laughs> I'll dry it off. This fabric really is waterproof and breathable. Yeah, and windproof. But that's something we'll be testing in another episode. Thanks for watching. Gordon and Ted did it again. They tested and proved the Gore-Tex guaranteed to keep you dry promise. For over 30 years, Gore has set the standard for the perfect mix of durable waterproofness, windproofness, and breathability. Fit for use again and again.